Hi, this is Asin. You are now watching Asin Math TV. Today, we would like to share how to integrate our second x with respect to x. In this video, we are going to apply the integration by plus. Let's record the formula. We have integrate u dv is equal to u times v minus integrate v du. We can let u be equal to our second x. And integrate dv be equal to integrate dx. When we differentiate u with respect to x, we obtain 1 over x times square of x squared minus 1, which means that du is equal to dx over x times square of x squared minus 1. On the other hand, when we integrate TV, integrate, differentiate, cancel each other, left only V. And so for the right hand side, left only X. Substitute into the formula, we should have U secant inverse X times V X minus integrate V X times DU, which is DX over X times square of X squared minus 1. X and X cancel each other, which means that we have X secant inverse X minus integrate 1 over square root of X squared minus 1 dx. To integrate the second term, we can apply integration by substitution. We let X be equal to secant Y. When we differentiate X with respect to Y, we obtain tangent y times secant y. Let's recall the trigonometric identity. Tangent square y plus 1 is equal to secant square y, which means that tangent square y is equal to secant square y minus 1. And hence, we have tangent y is equal to square root of secant square y minus 1. And we let x be equal to secant y, which means that we have x squared minus 1. Therefore, dx dy is equal to square root of x squared minus 1 times secant y. Let's rewrite the equation with x on one side without x on the other side. So we have 1 over square root of x squared minus 1 times dx is equal to secant y times dy. In other words, integrate 1 over square root of x squared minus 1 dx is equal to integrate secant y dy. And this is equal to ln tension y plus secant y with the constant c. And this is equal to ln tangent y is equal to square root of x squared minus 1. And secant y is equal to x. Therefore, the integration of all secant x is equal to x times all secant x minus ln square root of x squared minus 1 plus c. Remember to add the constant c. And hence with that. Okay, that's all for this video. Thanks for watching. Hope you like this. See you.